All right, so what I thought I'd do is create a really quick video for teaching online <coughs> because of this virus thing. All right, what you will get is this email and you have to forgive my crying, I've been cutting onions. So in this email, and I'm just gonna flip over so I can actually see it, you'll get this link and it'll say join the Zoom meeting. Now you'll get a specific link for a specific time that I'm going to be teaching. And what you do is, all you have to do is click on that link <coughs> and it will say open zoom and you click on open zoom and it will give you um a log you straight in and to be honest that's really it there's nothing else to do if there is an issue now you're not seeing it all logged in so what i'm going to do i'm just going to start a meeting um just, let's try and capture audio Okay, so, and that's it. And you, you'll see something like this, all right? There's nobody else joined in, so there's no list, and it'll, it actually disappears. Um, <clears throat> this is my control. But through this, so if I show you very quickly, this is my end, you can actually see my Chrome, my internet browser, and you have to use Chrome and you'll see it actually that's not chrome i was really bad with me that's uh <coughs> internet explorer so let's go to chrome oh there you go that's chrome and what i use on chrome is bit paper here's a bit paper it's lovely i can do lots of interesting things um the last thing i really did on here and we'll do it again was do circle theorems so if i give you a quick guide on and you can see what my end of it's like. So if I want to draw a circle, I go, oh, look, there's a circle. <clears throat> and then I'm just going to hide that away. I want to have a look at the radius so I can draw a little line there for the radius. And then if I want, I can drop in the tangent. That's slightly wrong. And the really nice thing for me to do here is I can rotate this so it is where I want it to be. I might rotate it like this. It's a bit sharp. I just want to time to rotation on it. Um, let's make it bigger there. Pull it in. And just rotate until we get it just right. Anyway, you get the picture. I'm not going to spend too much time on that. Now, how to get to... <clears throat> this bit of paper, we both can write on it to me and my student can write on it. If I want to, I can drop exam papers in here, exam questions. Uh, right now, I want to drop in um, an ex part of a textbook. So most of my textbooks I've got online as well. And these textbooks my students have got, um, can't really see it. So I'll just print screen very quickly. I'll just turn over. Come back to the screen. I'm going to go to page two. And as you can see it, I can see it. My students can see it. And we can work through what we're working through. So the question remains as a parent, as an older student, one of my A-level students, how do you get to that? The easiest way to get to that is to go into, oh, well, let's just, just end this meeting first of all. We don't need that. We don't need Zoom. Let's get out of Zoom. So if we go to the Mass and Science Tutor, which is one of my websites, <coughs> you go to the main screen, <coughs> scroll down to all the online lessons on bit paper. And if you click on that, you've got here a list of, well, this is GCSE problem solving. If we click on GCSE problem solving, you will bring up the current bit paper that we're working on and you'll have a specific one for a specific topic. And here there's a question. Uh, there's a there's a problem uh, from AQA, uh, and it's really nice, uh, uh, promise of a question, and we can do what we wish on that. Um, we can move the page around, uh, you know, show our working out, show our writing if we want. Um, 10 times 2, believe me, that's as neat as my writing gets. <coughs> we can zoom in. There's a whole lot of different things we can do on this. The really nice thing is that this is an infinite amount of workspace and I really like it. 
Spy. So I think that will do. Um, and I will send everyone this recording out. <coughs> if you have any problems at all, just you know, text me or drop me an email. Oh, look, there I am.